is Ryan Gray to bring you the top five WWE matches of the week from July 3rd through July the 27th week of 2023. Number five, the Diet versus the Creed Brothers from NXT. Loser leave NXT. 18 minutes was probably a little bit too long here for the Creed Brothers. The Creed Brothers still shrine very well here. Curious what's next for the Diet also. Three and a quarter stars. Number four, Grayson Waller versus Edge from Smith. Surprising we didn't get this match at SummerSlam. Surprising we got this match at, at MSG on SmackDown. Uh, Waller did a good job of looking good, not being in the ring the last two months. Edge even looked better, despite not being in the ring since probably WrestleMania. I like the shine that Edge put on Waller after the match. Solid. Three and a quarter stars. Number three, the Eddie Thorpe versus Damon Kemp. NXT Underground from NXT. This was way better than it had any right to be. I love the look of the arena here. It looked clean, yet grimy. I thought Kemp shined great here. He looked like an absolute stud with a very bright future. Thorpe's best match in NXT this so far. I also thought Gable looked awesome throwing dudes around afterwards, despite not really making sense and being kind of wonky. But despite all that, the physicality looked good. I like all three of these guys' future and very, very surprising. Three and a quarter stars. Number two, NXT's third match, Mustafa Ali's Tyler Bate. A callback to the style that Mustafa Ali crushed in 205 Live. I love the counter game and counter and brutal strikes between these two. And the story of both baby faces trying to outwork each other. Killer 450 from the top for Ali for the win. Three and a half stars. And number one for Monday, Rhea Ripley versus Natty. I love the story early of Natty attacking Rhea in her entrance. Gave real gave Natty the real hope that she needed coming into this match, despite getting squashed two matches in a row. Easily Rhea's best match since WrestleMania, but I really like the structure here of laying this out to give Natty hope, even though we kind of knew that there wasn't much hope coming in, but they, both girls did a good job of telling the story throughout the match. I really dug this. Way better than it should have been. Three and a half stars, closer to three and a quarters than you would think, too. Awesome match. All right, those are my top five matches for the week of July 3rd through July 9th, the 27th week of 2023. All right, guys, catch you next week.